Welcome to my fifth guide for the game Hidden Through Time. This time we are going to go into the first DLC for this game, The Viking Tales. Ten maps in total in which we have to search for several items. So let's hop straight through it, straight to it actually, and see how we do. Viking Tales, we start with Loki's Feuds. Loki's Feuds. All right, only six items to find. Let's have a look. The first one. Out of revenge for his brother's mockery, Loki hid his hammer and replaced it with a common one. Loki's hammer is hidden. It is right behind a little table over there in the weapon racks. He hid Freya's necklace so that someone would accidentally eat it. But the necklace is in between the food right here. To get revenge on Odin, he turned Munin, one of Odin's ravens, into a toad. Well, Odin in the middle, one raven on the chair, and a toad in front of the chair. Next up. For those mortals who dare to mock him, he poisoned the food. The food is poisoned in the pot with a little snake. He hid the medallion of a Valkyrie in a huge pile of treasure so that she would never find it again. Huge pile of treasure in the back. And a medallion right on top. Perched high, he alerted Loki to the mockery of the gods. Perched high, which means in a tree right here on the left. There we go. Onwards to level number two. The elf village. What we can do in the elf village is we can open up all the houses, which is always a good idea in case something is inside all right let's go they forgot a fork for you well here are people eating there's a fork on the table there we go next up i've tried to make a new fertilizer you need fertilizer in the gardens and in the house next to the gardens you find the fertilizer bottle next up at least the seat is comfortable well yeah, the seat is comfortable, but inside this house you can see that he is only ahead of his time, just ahead on the seat. You've traveled a long way to come see me in the house right next door. The Goblin King, or, or Goblin Wizard, whatever it is. Next up, a quiver of arrows, missed again. I'm going to have to get some new arrows here on the left. The arrows are everywhere and the quiver is right in front of the house. Next up is an egg. I keep the eggs safe inside of this house. The eggs are everywhere and a lonely egg on the dresser. We take that one. A little further and it would have fallen on my head. A pine cone here with a bear. Almost fell on the bear's head. Which means we can move on to map number three. There we go. The ritual. The ritual. Two houses we can open. There we go. First up, Odin's watching from above. Watching from above is always from uh, one of the trees. There he is. The raven in the tree. Next, we can only find these on one side of the forest. We can see all the mushrooms over here and the red one is right there in the middle. Let's take it. Watch out. Your dagger has fallen out of your ceremonial dress. We see all the guys in the ceremonial dresses right here. And the guy over here has the dagger falling out. There we go. The giant died with a sword in hand. And the giant sword is right here behind a tree. There we go. They keep on going deeper and deeper into our forest. I must inform the king. Here is the scout, the elven scout in the woods. Careful, don't trip over it on your way to the ceremony. The way to the ceremony, the path has one rock, one pebble sticking out. There we go. And the last one, he volunteered for the ritual, no worries. The skull on the table. There we go. Catches fire when you click it. Onwards to map number four. Fishing party. Fishing party, there we go. No houses to open, just the boats. 
First up, we don't usually use this kind of boat, but I have to admit that it's a nice one. It's the one up top here, the canoe. There we go. Nothing greater than a father and son fishing trip. Where's the father and son boat? It's right here. We click the sun. There we go. She was hiding on the figurehead of the ship. We didn't see a thing. Bottom left, here she is. On the figurehead. That's not bait. Get it out of the water. Right here, the guys are using a sword for bait. Doesn't work, mate. Damn it, I dropped my necklace on a block of ice. Well, many blocks of ice here, but here is the necklace on the block of ice. He was feeding on the dead dragon. Must have had really good taste. Little octopus. Where is the little octopus? Let's have a search around. Doo -doo -doo. There we go. The little octopus has been caught. Thank the gods I didn't forget my meal. I hope the campfire doesn't set the boat on fire though, yeah. Putting a campfire on a ship, not generally a good idea, especially on wooden boats. But here is the roast. And they are so efficient that they reel in a giant sword. The guys in the bottom left, look at all the fish they caught. And the giant sword right in the middle of it. Means we can move on to map number 5, which is the giant's forge. The forge. First up, this new hammer is very different from the previous one. As you can see, Thor is having his hammer right here at the giant's forge. He's not a slave, just a nice guy who wants to help. Where do we find this non-slave person who wants to help? Right here. On top of the bellows. Next up, Odin's raven is right here again. He may, up, he may end up being toasted if he doesn't move quickly. Right on top of the forge. There he is. This isn't cool, giant. This looks like coal, but it's not. It actually looks like looks like grapes. Here's a pile of coal. Also here, but where is the pile of coal that looks like grapes? This one behind. No, it's not. It's not that one. This one behind there. No, this one. No. Hmm. There should be one pile of coal that is actually, well, it looks like grapes, as I said before, it's not here, not that one, not that one, it's been hidden well. So many coal piles, it really could be anywhere. Bing. Ah, oh, here it is. You see the little black thing he's sticking out. There we go. He hadn't washed himself for months. About time. Yeah, this guy in the right next to the pot with the water. Go wash yourself. So here's your proof that my helmet isn't that big. See, here's the guy with the helmet. And the helmets right in front of him are even bigger. Next up. No enchantment without magic runes. Where do we find the magic rune? Right here on the giant's table is the rune. We should have a spare raven skull around here somewhere. Well, as you can see, all the skulls are at the top left, as is the raven skull right over there. All right, mortals can't pass, but what about the dead? Right in between the mortals here, the dead guy is standing. And there's only one chair for all these people in the waiting line. Right there is the chair. Which means we can move on to the next level. Invasion! Invasion! There we go. Viking invasion. First off, we're looking for this one. You can pass me your shield. I need it for the boat. Right here on the ship. He has all the sh uh, shields on the boat. He needs more shields. If you want to throw away my lucky charm, you'll first have to go through me first. The lucky charm hiding here behind the sails. There we go. An end of rope. I forgot to tie the rope. He's standing all the way backwards with the rope on the boat. Next up. Our longship is the strongest. That's because the figurehead is wearing a helmet right here. 
A pineapple. Why did you take all this? You don't even know the name of the fruit. As you can see to the left, the ship is filled with fruit and the pineapple is right next to the mast. I prefer to stay away. I'm not much of a fight. <laughs> These guys are carrying a sheep on their boat. A sheep ship, as you will. <coughs> Next up, something stuck in the sail. As you can see, all the sails are upwards except for this one, which is down. Because there is an arrow in it. Then we have a frozen guy. <laughs> Two coals here right in front of this sail. The frozen guy. Another dead guy. Fresh meat. Close. The dead guys are right here. There he is. In front of the house. And the last but not least. She likes to look pretty. Even giants. This one likes to look pretty with a little comb over there. Found it. The invasion ends. And we move onwards to the big tree. Yggdrasil. The big tree. Inside the tree. She feeds on the leaves of the trees. There she goes all the way up top. In the big tree. Next one. The three witches weave the destiny of each man. Their magic is powerful. The three witches are down here. And the magic is inside the witch's cauldron. Mimir, the talking head of the western spring, knows all sorts of things. Yet he doesn't know where his body is. The western springs. Here is the head. And his body is all the way up here. Next to the stone. And then only Odin knows the meaning of the runes. Odin is right here and the rune is right on this stone. One of the witches' sources of power. We saw that the witches were right down here and the, the staff is on the right. Right there. Bling. There it is. Then the ruby. The roots of Yggdrasil can create wonders. In the root is a ruby right here. Dragons love treasure. That's a well-known fact. The dragon is over here and the treasure is inside the dragon's skull to the left. There we go. Even kings succumb to magic. Just follow the bones. We have the witches right here. We follow the bones. Bone, 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 bone. And the skull is in the bushes. Next up. The birds of Yggdrasil only choose the golden trees for their nests. Here is a golden tree. Here is a nest of eggs. Found it. The fruits growing on this land can sometimes be a bit different. <laughs> yes, it's an eggplant, an aubergine, right here in the tree. That is weird. And the last one on this map. To be buried here, it must have been someone important. On the right, the lonely grave with the axe right next to it. Which means we can move on to the next map. The Viking Settlement. The Viking settlements. Lots of houses. Let's open them up first. In case something is inside. Always the first thing to do. Open up the houses. And the first thing to look for is again Thor's hammer. The weapon is perfect. It will. I will use it to bring glory to my family. Here the weaponsmith has the weapon. He just has to wait for the warriors to leave. Then he can attack the big ogre right here in the woods. Hiding. We must contain the dead. I hope this ritual works. Well, here are the ritual shamans. And there is the little rose in between. The red guy. Sorry, kid. You can't raid with us yet. Here's the raiding party. Find him right in between. Nice treasure, old man. You must be a great warrior. The treasure. Here's the old man. And there is the treasure pile. Right in his house. Next up, the carpet. It's rare to find this kind of cloth here. I'll take your entire stock. Here's the stockpile of cloth. There we go. Don't worry. After I sacrifice you, you'll join the gods. Where is the sacrifice? Where is the sacrifice? Good question. Is he sacrificing the sheep? Yes, he is. Because the knife is right there. Next up, chased by the wolves. He didn't have a choice but to hide. The wolves are in the woods. Here they are. And um, the little white dog hiding is on the left between the houses. There he is. Then there's, there's another frozen guy again. 
who didn't rise up like the others. Here are all the others, risen from the dead. And the frozen guy, still frozen solid. The boat builder is a lonely guy, but he has a great pet. The boat builder, here are all the boats being built, and the bear is inside his house. Why? I don't know. I hope no one notices that it's missing. Let's play. Because the kids have put the helmet on their snowman. There we go, we found it. Moving on to the next map. Ragnarok, the end of worlds, where we can see that the dead, the giants, the vikings and the dragons, they are all in one big fight. The ogres as well here on the right. Let's see what we can find. First up, open all the tents so we can see what's inside. Open all the elf houses as well. I accidentally clicked on something, which is the elf queen. I clicked on the elf queen right over there. Accidentally. Um, first off, we have a ritual skull again. I'm going to use it for one of my rituals. The guy here is performing a ritual and the skull is right over there. Next is a bucket. You really think you can calm them down with a bucket of water? Well, what do you use water for? You use it to put out fire. Dragons breathe fire. So the bucket is right over there. Next up. I forgot my bracelet on the dresser. Which is right here. The comb, the ruby, the bracelet on the dresser. Next one. Help me! Someone is in trouble. Here the guy is in between three flames in the flaming woods. We found him though. Next up. I will bury my treasures using a shovel. The guy here has all his treasures hidden and a shovel right next to it to bury it soon. These Draugr are on a date. How lovely. Here they are, two of them with a rose in the middle. Actually, I don't know how to read runic inscriptions, says this priest over here. Found him. She's a big fan of giant fights. Giant fights. Let's look for a giant fight. Here they are. Two giants fighting. And a little quack quack duck right here. Found him. If you stay close to me, everything should be okay. Says the mommy bear against her little cub. There we go. The golden leaf. The tree was probably precious. Where are the golden leaves? Right up here. The golden leaves and the precious, the ring in top, in top, on the top of the tree. And the last one, catapult me on top of that giant right here. If the woman jumps on that, he will be catapulted on top of the giant. The ore, the paddle is what we're looking for. And after this enormous battle, where do the Vikings go? They go to Valhalla. The last map of the Viking Tales. Let's have a look. Thor's hammer again. I can't eat in peace when there's a battle going right next to me. The battle here at the bottom. And Thor's hammer is right here. He cannot eat in peace. I have to use it when I see some, someone trying to get through the door. For which we go up the top. This uh, witch has the horn right underneath her. So she can blow the horn when someone enters. Next up, a Viking snowman has been waiting for a long time to enter the Golden Gate because he's right here. Next is a carrot, eating fat or healthy. We go to the, uh, the cooking places where we see the fat pieces of meat and a carrot right in between for the healthy people. My table neighbor left without his shield. Why would he do that? The shield is right here at the front of the table. And the next one is a sentimental treasure. An orange hat helmet. Odin's right here. He has the helmet right there. I knew I should have worn a blue outfit like all these people around me. Says the priest over here. Uh, no, 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 wrong. The priest. Or is it that priest? No, it's not. It is a priest somewhere. Where are all the guys in blue? I'm blind. I am blind. No, I'm not blind. It is this guy. Because these are all wearing blue and the priest is not. 
Fight me. The winner gets the weapon. Say the guys on the left. The weapon is right on the stump. These two guys are fighting for this dagger. Sit down on this stool. You can't walk in a straight line anymore. Because the meat supply is right over here. And the stool is in front of it. Next, I hit my treasure under the table. Right here, in between the Vikings, there's a little pile of treasure under the table. There we go. Food on the ground attracts bugs. Right next to the treasure is food on the ground. And the blue scarab, the blue bug, right in between. Wrong folklore, little boy. Anyway, how are you still alive? That's an amazing question. <laughs> because this guy is actually on fire. On the left, there he is inside the flame how is he still alive and then the most hidden item possibly in the entire world is the key to valhalla very well hidden where do people hi hide their keys exactly right under the mat there it is and that concludes the viking tales while uh, we started in a rather quiet place Heading into battle and ending in Valhalla. That is the story of the Viking Tales. Again, as in all my other guys, uh, uh, guides, not guys. I don't have that many guys. Um, amongst all my other guides, I also always tell you to please like this video. Subscribe to my channel if you find this informative. If you used my hints to finish your puzzles, of course I would like to urge you to finish the puzzles yourself at first and only use a guide if you really have to. But if you do decide to use a guide or recommend a guide to anyone else, please make it be mine. I mean, we're helping each other right in these times. I help you with the guide, you can help me with giving me some views and likes, subscribers, hopefully. You never know. I will catch you in the next and last guide for this game, which will be the Japanese adventures. Thank you for watching. See you next time. And I hope you have an amazing day. Thank you.